Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. You may find that the title of my video is a little bit strange for somebody who's living in the UK, Britain, and in a normal suburbatory home in a non-American environment. But however, I have really, really been taken for, I would probably say, a number of years around the whole idea of Thanksgiving. It's something which I'm actually in quite awe of. And it's something which I spent a lot of time looking into and understanding, and it's always something which has captured my eye and really, I've really loved what it stood for. And for a while, I'd probably say about maybe six, maybe, maybe even a little bit longer than that, years ago, when it was really something which I wondered what it all stood for and sort of really got me thinking and absolutely loved the whole essence behind it and the whole true meaning of uh, Thanksgiving to Americans and of course families across the world who celebrate it. And then it kind of got me thinking and I suppose it's that long ago, I think I must have been about 18, I'm 26 now, and I really loved what it stood for and I thought to myself, okay, I'm not American, we don't live in America, we don't have, uh, we, we don't necessarily have any connection. I hesitated when I said that as one of my brothers now. His partner is an American, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, but back then, of course, that wasn't that wasn't the case. Um, but it's something which is really, really kind of in a way captured my heart to think, how can I take something like that and incorporate that in my life? And of course, from then I did. And it was something which on the day of Thanksgiving, I would always take the day off, so since then I've taken the day off of work, I've booked it as holiday, and I've prepared a really lovely, stereotypical meal of what possibly an American family would have in Thanksgiving. So for example, I found an incredible recipe and made it my own of pumpkin pie. I found an amazing recipe for candied yams, and we had the turkey, and we had all the trimmings and the vegetables, and i done that, not necessarily just to recreate it, but in a way to start something of a tradition in my family particularly in my family home and those people who live in our family home, where it's a time where we can reflect, we're coming to the end of the year, and with those who we love, we share thanks and we really appreciate what we have, those around us, and us being well and healthy and really look as a celebration of everything we have and how privileged we are in our lives. And that's not just me. I find it so, so important that we take a step back in life and really appreciate how good things are in our life, what we have, and spare a thought for those others who aren't necessarily in those positions. And for me, it was a, it's it's a time where it's kind of almost like the gateway that Christmas is really starting. And I'm sure that's the case for a lot of Americans. But for me and my family, it's a tradition which I've started. And now it's just incredible. So in my family home, we, we come together, we have a really, really lovely meal where me and my mum prepare that. My mum's absolutely amazing cook. And it's a really lovely, lovely time. Um, we have really, really lovely foods and, in, 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 it's just incredible. And it really, really is lovely. I mean, it's, it partly helps my mum's such an amazing cook. Um, and, and she actually taught me and that comes from my grandmother on her mum. And, and my brother's a chef and, and it's really, really great. So that part of it is sorted. But what I try to insist, particularly um, where my eldest brother is actually at home with us at the moment and he uh, and his uh, partner is in America. Um, unfortunately, we haven't got him here this year, but nevertheless, he's all having an amazing time actually in America. Um, but I'm here with my parents and we are going to have a really, really lovely, amazing meal later on coming together. And it's really, really nice. I get to share some time with my mum and dad. We have a really amazing time. We've prepared a lovely meal today. I'm actually just about to finish my pumpkin pie. I will be uploading a picture. Don't worry about that. Um, but it's something which I really, really love. And it's a tradition which we started in my family, um, in my family home, or for me, where we come together, we show that appreciation, we show that thanks, we give thanks for those who are with us and spare a thought for those around us. And even in my own family currently are going through horrific times, which I won't mention. It's far too private. But all I want to say is that my thoughts are with them and through what they're going through. I'm right there with them and my love and best wishes. That's something which I won't open up, um, but they know who they are watching this and I really, really feel for them and I'm with you every step of the way. And 
I'm just hoping that everything turns out right, and I'm sure it will. Um, I, do, I do believe in God, and I, and I do believe that all these things happen for a reason, but I'm right there. I'm right there with you. But today, for me, it's talking about that tradition which we have. So, yeah, okay, Thanksgiving is for United States of America, but having been kind of taken back by, by it and really mesmerised and in awe of it, I really love what it stands for. So my own family home, we've created that tr tradition of all coming together, showing that appreciation, showing that love, that, that happiness, all coming together for thanks and how, how, how almost like a standing mark that we have each other, everybody's healthy, and really showing appreciation for that, showing gratitude. For me, it's for my family, it's for my parents, it's for what they do, how how supportive and how incredible they are in the things they do. And and it's great. And living in such an amazing family home and having everything and and, and it's just so much done for you and having an amazing childhood and upbringing and, and now having an incredible support network as a young adult. And for everything what's done for me, family, parents and bless her, my nan. Unfortunately, being with Aunt Summer, she can't share that with us. But I've got so many happy memories of her being top of our table, of having big, lovely meals. So coming together, having those big, lovely sit down meals with family is something very, very special to my heart. And it's a tradition based from that amazing aspect of Thanksgiving. And we do it every every year. Every year it comes up. I mark it on my calendar. I book that time off of holiday. And it's something I do. I always make pumpkin pie. One of my brothers, I won't say his name, absolutely loves pumpkin pie. It's my niece and nephew's birth tomorrow. I will birthday tomorrow. I will be taking him over a piece tomorrow as well. Um, but that's another shout out I want to do today. My niece and nephew, I won't mention their names, bless them. It's their birthday tomorrow. And for tomorrow, I will be visiting them and I wish them an absolutely amazing birthday. And my love and best wishes to you both. But no, so today was all about me talking about a little quirkiness and something which we've really worked on or I have and yeah it's becoming a tradition and it's something which is amazing and today my mum's cooked an absolutely beautiful amazing meal and I'm finishing off the pumpkin pie sometimes we do it together sometimes my mum does it or I do it but this year predominantly it's been my mum and I've done the pumpkin pie but yeah really really lovely and mixture of emotions here today with what's going on in the background with my family but mainly I wanted to capture this on my channel as you know it's the my channel is all about the bumpy road of life a lot of good things and unfortunately those small things um, in the background which necessarily we take for granted and today for me is all about taking that taking that and let's really really show gratitude let's really really be thankful for what we have and our appreciation towards others and what's done for us and what we do and for what we have and yeah just an amazing and why not have that today and and of course it doesn't have to be one day of the year i try to be like this and my family tries to be like that all throughout the year but i always make a mark and it's just a lovely gateway towards the festive season as well really humbling really really warming and a lovely lovely time so that's my take you can call that a british take on a thanksgiving okay so thank you very very much for watching and if you are american and you do celebrate thanksgiving Happy Thanksgiving to you today and my best wishes and love for the next year ahead. And I hope you all have an amazing festive season ahead. And I really, really cannot say how much I've enjoyed this clip today. Absolutely lovely. And thank you so, so much for watching. OK, and for those two who hopefully are watching, God bless you. And my wishes are with you and I'm right there with you. You know who you are. Thank you very, very much for watching. And until next time, we will see you then. Bye bye now.